And I don't know that that's actually the case. I feel like they might actually just be playing her, and I feel like they're sitting in the middle pretty with Ally and Liv as their actual final four and hoping to, or trying to get you guys in their good books for moving forward in this game. Yeah. I feel like it doesn't affect, it's not even me trying to play anything because it literally doesn't affect my standing. If I don't get one of Ally, Liv, or Kayla's votes, I'm out of these doors anyway, you know? Yeah. So saying that it could actually like hurt my game, but just like, if I leave this house, you want us to Ryan know. is not your guys' target. <laughs> yeah. Or shouldn't be in that case. And if you guys feel safe with like Dela or Ally and Liv, then you're being played. The same way I very much was played, the same way Erica was played by Ally and Liv. No, and I, I definitely think there's some truth to that for sure. <sighs> I mean, I guess you won't know what's gonna happen until the veto. Well, you gotta go out and win the veto, man. Yeah. Yeah, I believe that. But I also do know that, I mean, I don't know, but I don't think they're a final four. No, I think there's room there for that to be shaked up. Um, in that, like, should Dela find themselves in the block alley, and they'll be like, okay, we'll put one of them, you know what I mean? And like, yeah. move forward, like with everything in this game. But I don't know that it means that they're against each other in the triple. Yeah, 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 fair. It just sucks, because it means, like, for sure I won't be able to even talk about this vote after. What's that? Uh, it just sucks, because it means that, regardless of what happens to this veto, I won't have any, like, room for... If you win. If, I mean, if I win, of course, but... If you win, man, damage could be fucking done. True. True, true. You're a competitor, though, Johnny. You gotta go out there and get it. Yeah. <sighs> oh. Excuse me. Where's my water bottle? I don't know. Orange? Yeah. Yeah, I never saw it. No, it's not here. Is that it? No, but I don't think I took it out of here today. Unless I did, and I don't know where it is. Whoa. Yeah, you got to win, man. I know, obviously, you know that. Yeah, there's like, it just sucks too because, you know, when you're in this game and you're about to go home, you know you don't just like rest and not say anything, but I know that it's hopeless. Yeah. It's almost like I owe it to myself to at least try, but it's just like, it's so cringy to even try when I already know the result. Well, do you think that Eileen Liv actually won't give you their vote? If you weren't to win? Yeah, no, I don't think so. What? I really? They, and that's exactly indicative of them being with Dela way more than they ever were with me. Which sucks, but... Why would they do that, though? Like, I thought that they, you were, like, fucking so, so tight. Yeah, but, I mean, you know that I've had reservations about Ali, and I've expressed that to some people. I guess word just trickles around, like... Who would have said my bank said to her? I don't know. It's not worth trying to figure out. But, I mean, I feel like that was enough for her to, like, ditch Eric and I and instead go with Derek and... Kayla, because it makes more sense too. Eric and I were way more well connected through this house, whereas Dela. Yeah, aren't. but the way that that went is that Kayla said, "Which one of you is going on the block?" Because one of you is going on but the block. But you weren't in that room. Why wouldn't they say that to everyone? Is the only believable way for why they didn't hit the block again? You know what I mean? Yeah, I think so. That is the way that went. Why? Because I don't know. I just like it was just so sudden, and it had to happen so away. I don't know. I feel like I saw Ali and Liv acting in that moment. And they knew full well that Erica was going up. No. And they walked around the couch now, like whispering and shit like that. Yeah. Like Maddie ditched me in her I think so. Maddie ditched what? I think she ditched me in her over them now. Yeah. 
That's like what you got to win, man, so you can stay for at least another week, you know what I mean? Yeah. I know. And whoever's up there, no one who's up there is going to use the veto for you, man. No one is. No. This is going to be the hardest he went all season, do you think? The hardest what? Do you think this is going to be the toughest like he ever went? Like the hardest in the comps? Yeah. Well, for sure. I mean... But I just don't know what it's going to be, right? Oh my god, I do so much laughing about it if I saw you win. Yeah, I'm... Yeah, like, I hate when people keep on saying the triple, the triple, the triple. Like, you don't even know if there is a fucking triple. That's bullshit, is why. It's the reason why it's the one thing they'd be comfortable saying. Like, it's acting when they say things like... I mean, I feel comfortable saying it right now. Like, I'm after Ali and Liv. That's what I'm doing. Like, that yeah. you literally would not play it like that if that was no. true. No, no. And, like, weeks ago, Derek fucking saying that was, like, all... I, I can tell when Derek lies. He has yeah. some tells, you know, when he yeah. says, like, well, yeah... I mean, there, there's Ali and Liv. Obviously, everyone knows that we're after them and stuff. Like, I proposed, or I would like talk about Maddie to Maddie like weeks ago, how it came in this game, thinking it'd be cool to make like a Devils alive. It's like you find some person in the game who you openly express that you're like coming after and stuff, but really, you guys are both not coming after each other, and you just constantly find excuses for why you don't put them up on the blog. And that keeps you both safe because then everyone knows who your target is, but it's not actually your target. You know what I mean? Yeah. That's exactly what they've done here. I don't know. Do you think there is more meat still I would for them? Yeah. I'm, Erica used to tell me, too, like, it's really weird. Like, I feel like when Kayla and Derek sit down and talk with us, I feel like they want, because they've, like, proposed to name the alliance, too, and Erica was like, I don't want any of that. Like, I don't want to work with Derek and Kayla. All with her, the five people? Yeah. With the four and an Erica? Yeah, yeah, And every time I would talk to Allie and Lou about it, they'd be like, no, 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 it's like nothing, it's nothing. Then I'd talk to Erica, and she'd be like, it's really something, you know? So, like, Allie and Lou were trying to downplay it to me this entire time, whereas mm -hmm. Erica is not. How long ago was this taking place? Um, during Erica's reigning weeks. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. When Erica was HOH? Mm -hmm. Before or after the six? Before. Before? Yeah. But Eric, like, they always presented it to me as like, oh, it's nothing, it's just us like keeping Dale at bay kind of thing and stuff. And I believed that, thinking that that was the case, you yeah. know? But it would make sense for Allie and Liv to ditch Erica and myself in favor of those guys. How would it make sense though? I don't understand. Because like. who else do they have in this game? If they're willing to ditch Erica, then they're willing to ditch me. Why would they do that unless they had other people in this game? They don't have any of you white room people. So they must think in their minds that they have Derek and Kayla going forward. Yeah, I guess so, hey? Otherwise they'd be like, we need Johnny in this house. You know what I mean? Dayla set up the best in this house now. Yeah. Easily. Erica should have took her chance when she had the chance. Yep. Yep. I don't know why she never... Because even she was fooled by the fact that it seemed like they were on the outs and she felt good with them because they had that, like, five-person agreement deal, whatever. But, like, once the six got together and we started voicing against Dela, it's like Allie and Liv just fucking... We're not having that. And I'm sure it went to them. Explain that all out. And that's why last week Kayla was bullshitting me the entire time and I felt in my gut I could tell her that she was, that she knew I was after her. Why well, do you think Ali and them were going back saying Yeah. Do think they were going back saying that we were all after her? Potentially. Like when Ali gets in her real like acting moments, you can just tell she's bullshitting like, you know, we just felt like strong armed by you guys sometimes. Like you wanted Derek or Kayla, or you wanted Kayla, or yeah, Derek instead of Kayla gone first and all this stuff. And it's like, what the fuck are you talking about? Yeah, it's fucking weird the way it all works. It's okay, I'm just venting. Um, yeah, I mean, good luck to you in this game because I feel like you are. I mean, who knows? Things change. 
Who knows, man? We guess you gotta wait till the night anyway, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, how happy will you be? Fucking, who is the Beatle, man? Have a whole new chance at this game again. Imagine if you won the HOH, like, won the Beatle, won HOH. That'd be crazy. Who would you want? Exactly. I'm scared of shit at heart. Yeah, exactly. I keep mad because, like, I don't even hate her, so. Yeah. I would fucking love it, but those dreams don't come true for a lot of people in this game, so I can't get too excited about it. Yeah, no. I think you're going to fucking, I have a feeling you're going to win, man. To be yeah, that's nice of you to say. But yeah, you never know what kind of thing. No. Man. I've lost many competitions in this game, so. At least fucking you got like weaker competitors to play against you. Know? Yeah, that's still Derek though. Derek, the fucking fake ass, doesn't know anything about this game and just clearly watched it a ton. He's definitely seen, like, as a fan of the show. He doesn't need to constantly be, like, reminding people that he knows nothing about this game up if he didn't, you know what I mean? It's yeah. like, every fucking day, he's like... But, I mean, this is all news to me, and, like, I'm learning about Big Brother more and more every day. It's like, okay, dude, like, it's been 40 days of this. I get it. Yeah. I haven't seen the show. I'm like... Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Overrun. Won't it be shady for, like... For one thing, the first thing, to six. What about that? Like, Ali and Liv, me and Paris, that's four there. If you could bring that up. And then Maddie's in the next group. Maddie was such a good friend to you, you know what I mean? No, Maddie, yeah. I mean, I hear what you're saying, but like, I don't think that stuff's gonna have any pull with me sitting on that block, but I mean. I don't know. Cause I guarantee if they stay in that game, man, you go home, they're gonna run this game. Yeah. And people are too fucking ignorant and arrogant to see it. Yeah. Hold on, I just want to check there again. People are fucking slow on me. So happy about that. Which is huge. Get that little gremlin out of here. <laughs> She's so annoying. Yeah. She's just so fake. I'm so annoyed that during her HOH week I let her have any kind of like opinion on what I do with that view. Yeah. I'm so annoyed about it. Yeah, honestly, I wish you'd have used the video to take me down. They might yeah. Erica probably still would have been there. I don't know about that. I think that if someone comes up, if someone would have come off that night, no matter what, and Erica would have gone up and out. Yeah, but if Erica was hit, went up instead of me, and I think Canada would have voted for Erica than overrun, you know what I mean? Maybe, yeah. Just too many different ways <sighs> you got on the nose, right? Paris, like, she, she won't even sit down and talk, really, man. Like, fuck. Paris? Yeah, like, she's just, we were there talking to her. Where'd she even get up and go to? Why? I'm just wondering, like, think she would've stayed here and chatted, you know what I mean? I know, I felt like she just... That's the way people get when someone's on the block to be afraid to talk to you, right? Be seen with you. That's exactly what it was. Because as soon as someone's HOH, everyone runs the HOH and kisses yep. ass. Yep. I am a dead man walking. 
Yeah, if you don't win that veto, I don't know how it's gonna play out. Well, if they're gonna keep in Ryan over you, if that's their plan, they must have some kind of deal made with Ryan, too. They'll have to. You know mm, what I mean? No, I probably just seem more threatening than Ryan. Yeah, but they're gonna have to make some deal with Ryan, like after doing what they done last week to him, mm. and then him staying. He said he tried to make a deal with him. Oh, he's so full of shit. Don't tell that guy anything, man. 